three, two, one, a push! Good evening, guys. It's Fit Nerd here, and we're going to be talking about Captain America Civil War. Um, this is going to be spoiler free. Spoilers. I will not be giving away any spoilers in this entire video. I will wait at least a week, which by that time I will have seen it at least three times in theaters. Um, I just got back from watching five movies that are all connected and led to Civil War. Um, I did something called the Captain America Ultra Marathon in which we're in the theater from 7 a.m. till 10 o'clock at night watching all of the movies that led to this, this pivotal movie that we've all been waiting for. Um, we got a neat little badge that shows us all the movies that we've seen. This right here, and it shows us the schedule with our breaks and when we do get breaks after every single movie. The first movie that we saw was Captain America, um, the first Avenger. Second movie that we watched was The Avengers. Third movie, Captain America, The Winter Soldier. So awesome to see in theaters again, by the way. Um, Avengers, Age of Ultron, and then finally the big finale, which is Captain America, Civil War. Now, not only do we get this, you know, cheesy little VIP band. This is just so we could show the movie theater that we're doing a marathon and we're there all day long. Um, we get a designated theater. They will, we're in there all day and then we end up watching the movie in 3D. Um, besides this, we actually do get some pretty cool swag. We get a nice little medal, which actually has some really good weight on it. This is the medal itself. On one side you get um, Team Iron Man and on the other side, you're going to get Team Cap. I am Team Iron Man. I love Iron Man and I love his whole team. I love Cap also, but I am still going to be on Team uh, Iron Man for this one. Plus, he's got Spidey. Come on. He's, he's got Spidey. Um, we're going to be talking about Tom Holland's Spider-Man versus the other Spider-Man. Swag itself, not only do we get the medal, we get a nice little pin too, a collector's pin, which is right here. This is the pin itself. Um, it's a pretty cool pin. I'll bring it up. You'll see it on the side right here. Um, it has a half of Cap Shield and the other half of Arc's uh, the arc reactor from uh, Iron Man's chest. Um, pretty cool little collectible. And on top of that, we also get a limited edition comic to come with it too, which is this one right here. We get the Avengers Alliance. It's a nice little comic, not that big of a read, but it is cool collectible swag that we only get with, well, going to the marathon itself. And on top of that, they did have trivias where they gave away little keychains and goodies also throughout the entire marathon itself. So, now let's get to the gist of things. Captain America Civil War. Now, this movie, like I said before, they did an amazing job connecting all of these movies. Um, it really all led up to this moment with uh, these movies, which is, like I said, this is the list. Captain America, First Avenger, then we got The Avengers, then we got Winter Soldier, then we got Age of Ultron. You watch all these, and then you watch Civil War. They are all one gigantic story. It is amazing how the cinematic universe, the Marvel Cinematic Universe did with this. Um, at moments in the movie, I was definitely, I mean, I went in as Cat Team Iron Man, but at moments you're gonna see, you know, all right, um, they, they both have their valid points. You're gonna be, you know, being pulled back and forth throughout the entire movie. All right, Team Cap has a valid point. Team Iron Man, valid point. And you're going to see the division between all of the superheroes here. Um, and there are a lot of them. And it does not get cluttered. Not cluttered at all. Every single superhero gets their, their, their moment. Their solo moment. They did an amazing job. Even Black Widow have their moment. Vision, Scarlet Witch, Black Panther, Spidey. They're all going to have their moments. And you're going to see each and every one of them kick some serious ass. Because this movie has its drama, it has its story, and there's some major ass whippings here and there. Spidey and Black Panther, their intros were just perfect. They were just, there's no origin story. We're not going to get, they, they didn't go into any origin story. They just put into the, the, their characters into the movie itself. 
Um, Tom Holland as Spidey. Yes! Finally! Finally they have the Spidey that we want. He is comedic, he is sarcastic, he never shuts up, he thinks out loud, he is the younger, you know, Spidey that we all are used to or have seen. Um, they got it right. I, I, I mean, don't get me wrong, I, I still like Toby. Toby was a good Spidey. Then they went with Garfield, and Garfield was a you know, he was a good Spidey, but this is the definition of who Spider-Man is. And Tom Holland as Spider-Man, just give it two thumbs up. Did amazing. Um, Black Panther, Black Panther being introduced to this movie, he kicks so much ass. I mean, he makes it look so easy. And all the ass whipping that he does in this movie, I'm just going to leave it at that. Just leave it at that. Man, he kicks some serious ass. He's just like, bah! Everywhere. Ah! Oh my god, I, I, I want a Black Panther costume. By the way. Yeah, I am going to work on this. Um, the story itself, amazing. Team Cap, Iron Man, the clash between the two, the battle itself alone. I could watch just the battle alone at least a good 500 times. Just the battle alone between the two teams. It was so well done. It has its comic relief. It has its action. It has its, uh, its dramatic moments of emotion. It, all of these, you know, they were all mixed up, but they all, just, the transition in between them was so perfectly done. Oh my God. All right. Um, was the movie awesome? Yes. Am I going to hear the question, how did it do against Batman vs. Superman? Let's just get that out of the way. Let's just get the big, you know, the pink elephant in the room. It, it, sorry, Batman and Superman. I liked your movie, but there are four other movies that led up into this pivotal moment. It, there was no mashup whatsoever. I was concerned with having so many superheroes in one single movie, but they all were just... They had their moments in so many movies that we all are familiar with them. And to have them into this movie, we already have their backgrounds. We already have their stories. We don't need it. They, they, they have a whole entire universe. And it led up to this moment of the Civil War, which was so perfectly done, so perfectly written. The acting was amazing. The action was amazing. The special effects just on point. Spidey's new costume, just awesome. Um... For you cosplayers out there, you got your work cut out for you, especially in this outfit. Um, uh, there were some upgrades on uh, the outfits, you will see that. Again, that's not a spoiler. I mean, that is just something worth wanting to see. Um, we, we, we were wanting to see more upgrades, and we got them. So, on an ending note, this movie is freaking amazing. I am definitely going to go into theaters and watch it at least another two to three more times in theaters. Um, do I suggest you guys want to watch this movie more than once? Yes. Um, did it hold up to all the all the hype? Yes. Um, was the action kick ass? Yes. Costumes? Yes. Characters? Yes. Moments? Yes. Um, just a plain old boom. Fabulous. Marvel? Mwah. It's just a work of art. Thank you. That is amazing. Um, catch my video next week where I'm going to give out all the spoilers. I am going to give out spoilers. And on an ending note, I will... Uh... Oh, and yes, I won't give out the ending credits uh, scene, the post credit scene. There are... Uh, this is not a spoiler, but I will give you guys a heads up because you guys are going to miss it if I don't tell you. There are two post credit scenes, so stick through all the way to the end. You see people leaving? Too bad. Stay there to the very end. There are two post credit scenes. You must watch them. Freaking awesome. Again, it's Fit Nerd. Catch you later. Boom! Three, two, one, a blue!